Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video and today we have a quick one. We'll show you guys three simple settings that will help you fix battery drains on your iPhone. Now, battery drain is of course a huge problem with mobile devices and on iPhones we have a lot of different updates that come out that actually cause battery drains more than the old ones, especially now with iOS 17.4 I'm seeing a lot of users reporting that the battery is actually draining really really fast. So here are three simple settings that I believe will help you fix the battery drain issue on your iPhone. The first one will be here under the Wi-Fi network. Works. So you go to your settings, you go to Wi-Fi, and you will find something here called Ask to Join Networks. Now, by default, this will be on Notify, and also it will be on Ask. If you switch to it, it will ask you whether you want to join a network or not. The other one, Notify, will notify you once your iPhone has automatically connected to a network. Now, what this does is basically scanning all the time for Wi-Fi networks that are available near you for you to connect your device. Now, of course, what that does is drain your battery because the iPhone is all the time active, all the time scanning for a new Wi-Fi network. What I want you to do is head on to this section right here and switch this off. Now, of course, when you're on a place, you know, you have like there like trusted networks, you can just go ahead and connect to them. You don't need to have this on automatic because most of the time you won't actually be using this and it will just drain the battery out of your iPhone. Now this right here is also really interesting and it plays a huge role on the battery life of your iPhone. Head on to your settings, go under your seller data and then go here to voice and data and it will have of course here a few different like types of networks you can choose from 2G up to 5G. Now one thing I want you to do is pay attention to 5G right here. If you choose 5G Auto, you know that your iPhone will all the time be trying to connect to 5G, that way draining the battery out of your iPhone. Now what happens here is that if you're on a place where the 5G coverage is not that good, your iPhone will be all the time using LTE or 4G but at the same time trying to connect to 5G, that causing the battery of your iPhone to drain really really quick. So if you're on a place that you know you don't have good 5G coverage, make sure you switch to LTE here is the best thing you can do and that way of course also save a ton of battery for your iPhone. And last but not least are haptic feedbacks and vibrations. So when you go to your iPhone and you have a ton of notifications turned on, you will also have a haptic feedback on those notifications. Now what, that hap what happens there is that the iPhone is all the time engaging the haptic engine, basically the vibrating engine on your iPhone, that way draining the battery out of your iPhone. Now there are a few things you can do here. First of all, under sounds and haptics, you will have here a few options. Now I always use never play, so I never play haptics on my iPhone, but you can choose to don't play in silent mode, at least do that. So don't play actually when your iPhone is not on silent mode. When it's on silent mode, of course you can have the vibrations. Then you will have the same here for the haptic feedbacks for the system and then also haptic feedback for your keyboard. And then if you go under accessibility here, you will also have another option to completely turn off a vibration for your device. So if we go right here under the touch settings, you will have vibration. There's a switch with, where you can actually completely switch off the vibration engine on your iPhone and that way saving a ton of battery. So that's it for this video guys. These are three quick settings that will help you fix the battery drain issue on your iPhone. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and of course, subscribe for more. And I'll see you on the next one.